Hey guys, today is going to be one of my shorter videos. I am doing an unboxing of the Resiners Airless Bubble Removal Machine. I am super excited. They just sent this to me and I have been dying to try it. Um, let's open this up. I kind of already checked the instructions out. New toy, how exciting. The color is super pretty. It's like a minty green. I believe I have it upside down. Ah. So there it is. We're gonna set that to the side. And it comes with some mixing cups and the plug and the instructions. Okay, so the instructions say to try to keep it on a rubber mat if you can. Um, so the way that this works is you put your resin inside and then you put the top on and then there's this little silicone seal here. You wanna make sure that is plugged in. That's gonna keep it airtight inside. And then you close it in. So you power it on and then the AI mode will change it from five minutes to nine minutes. You press start and then it takes about three seconds before it starts working. When it's done, you're gonna remove the rubber piece here, the silicone piece, and that will release the air and then you can take it out. So today I'm gonna be working with EPO Artists Epoxy Resin. Um, it's a one-to-one -one ratio, three minute mixing and 30 minute working time. And the packaging is super beautiful. The box looks just like this, I love it. But anyway, so I'm gonna go mix up two ounces of resin. So I'm gonna mix up two ounces of resin and then I'm gonna use this mold from the Wet Resin Queen, a little foil here and a couple flowers. And since it's almost Halloween, I'm just gonna do a little Halloween dish and it needs to be super clear on the top with no bubbles so hopefully we're gonna get rid of all the bubbles with this machine I am super excited so I'm gonna mix up two ounces of resin and I will be back okay so I mixed up my two ounces of resin I'm gonna put the cup inside I'm gonna put the top on make sure that the valve is closed here. Just making sure that's snug. Put the top on. We're going to press the on button and I'm going to change it to nine minutes and then I'm going to press start and then I'm going to move the camera down. and do a time lapse. I'm gonna speed it up so you can see what's going on. But you could hear the machine starting to work. All right, it's done. Now I'm gonna let it sit for about 30 seconds before I hit the release button. Guys, that is amazing. All right, I'm gonna hit that release button. I'm holding my phone with my hand the release is on the top. You're going to hear a, a release sound like kind of like a pressure cooker. All right. And then let me get this out perfectly clear. Okay. Camera wise, this was the hardest video I had to film because of my camera setup. But look at that. It is just crystal clear. 
there are no bubbles at all. So that machine is amazing. It's a game changer and I'm gonna start my mold. And I'm just gonna pour a little bit in really slow. Crystal clear. Okay, and I have tweezers here. And I'm going to put in my resin foil, my holographic pumpkin. And I'm creating a couple bubbles with this pumpkin, but I'm getting them out. I'm just making sure that it goes underneath the resin. And I'll wipe these tweezers off with a baby wipe. Just a tiny bit more. This mold is really shallow. That's why I'm going easy with the first layer of resin because we still need to put a back layer. I'm just making sure everything's covered up. It's still perfectly clear. I'm gonna wipe this off, my tweezers off with the baby wipe. And then I'm gonna come in with my flowers. And I know I wanted one here at the bottom. And I wanted this leaf to go over the top, sort of like this. Pull it down a little more. I had it set up perfectly before I put it in the mold. And now, of course, I don't remember how I had it. But I remember it was something like this. I wanted my flowers down at the bottom of the pumpkin. Grab that guy, set him there. And then I'm just gonna drizzle a tiny bit of resin so that my flower is covered. It's still completely clear. I, With my luck, I'll probably get a little bubble underneath the flower. I did see, um, I think it was on TikTok, someone actually put their flowers in the cup with the machine. All right, so I'm gonna quit messing with it. I'm pretty sure I got everything where I want it. That's gonna have to do. So I'm gonna let this cure. I'm gonna use this resin on something else. Let's get something that can show how clear it is. Okay, these are some little molds from Danner Builds. And this is a little sharky. A turtle and a hummingbird.
And look at that, perfectly clear. All right, so we're gonna come back in the morning and do one more layer over the top of that pumpkin. I'm thinking like an interference gold maybe. And then we'll be de we'll demold it, we'll demold these, and it will be done. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you tomorrow. <clears throat> hey guys, so I'm back and I'm just gonna pour this last layer for this little tray. I'm going to be using Hidden Treasure from Island Micas and More. Um, this is an interference color, so it's interference gold. So if you put it on a light surface, it will be a pearl color with a gold sheen. But if you were to put a little bit on a dark color, just put a little bit there, then the gold will really pop. It's a really beautiful color. So I'm gonna be using that and I'm gonna put a little swirl of red orange from Marabou alcohol ink in there just to get a little color going. Okay guys, so I forgot to turn the camera on when I was filming this. Also, the machine, the resin bubbler machine, I didn't use it for this, we didn't need it, but it's available on Amazon and they also sell it in their store. <clears throat> And they have given us a coupon code, Resin Fanatics, capital R, capital F, all one word. And you can receive, you will receive, and you will receive 15% off the machine. That's a lifetime code. So they have made that for my followers. That's pretty awesome. So the link to the Amazon and to the official site is in the description box underneath the tutorial, underneath the video, and also everything that I have used in the video. So we're going to let this sit. Um, till it cures and I'll come back and demold this and demold these clear ones and then this video will be done So I will see you guys shortly. Thanks for watching Hey guys, I'm back. My camera is on this time and I am ready to demold <clears throat> So we're gonna do the little pumpkin first Super cute Super clear. I really like this machine a lot. I'm definitely gonna do, be doing more projects with it. This is the Hummingbird. Crystal clear, not one bubble. There was a um, surfboard mold that I did before that I wish I had this machine back then. This is the turtle mold. Look at that. It's amazing. And then the shark. I think it had a little bit of glitter in the mold. So that's going to pick up on the shark. But check that out. So all in all, the machine works. I highly recommend it. It's a game changer, guys. You need to get one. Um, thank you for watching my tutorial. If you liked it, please hit the like button. And if you want to see more of my tutorials, please hit the subscribe button. Leave a comment. Um, ask any questions you want. I try to answer as soon as I can. And thank you guys for watching. I truly appreciate it. Have a good day. Bye.